Hi, this is Mike Hendrickson from Strada in Barcelona. I'm here with Karma Artigas. Karma, how are you doing? Very well, thank you. Enjoying the event and the venue. Excellent. So, how is the, the conference for you? Are the people here the right tribe, the right group? Yes, I mean, we have been collaborating also in the organization because this venue is uh, held in Barcelona, which is our hometown. So we are, in fact, the city partner. So we have been involved in uh, with the Strata team, and it's a success. So we are happy because we have brought here, for the first time ever, Head of World and Strata in Europe. And it's something that was needed because even though Europe is taking path and it's slower than the U.S., but more and more uh, that's getting momentum and there was a need of knowledge and, and having the access to the leaders of the industry that was necessary, yes. And so what does Synergic do? So we are a consultancy firm. We are having companies in this transformation focused on big data, technologies and solutions, also in data science. So we have a group of data scientist teams that are helping companies uh, basically in, in Europe as we are uh, based in Madrid, Barcelona and also in Zurich in, in Switzerland from all sectors, uh, helping them uh, adopting the, the value of big data in their businesses. So we are helping this transformation. So do you help a business from like uh, trying to figure out what their data strategy is all the way down to how do they get the data from one machine to a data lake or a repository? Or uh, I, I would say you're helping them in the whole roadmap because be, before they are ready to to really uh, adopt, tactics. yes, yeah. adopt big data technologies. So we have, you know, we're coming from the data management world. So we have a holistic view of data, from data management, integration, quality, master data, data governance, big data, and data science. What we have seen the last two, three years is that big data is changing a lot of paradigms and we're helping mostly companies become data driven. That means that we uh, help them understand where is their data value, what is the economic value of the data. We understand and design their big data reference architectures to put in place, understand how those architectures and help them implement those architectures together with existing technology. Um, above all, work with the business departments to gain new, gain new insights about data because they are absolutely uh, uh, unknown about what the potentiality of the data they have in their house is in their companies uh, can can um, provide the new insights and together with external data or open data so we you know help them discover all these new insights for business reasons do you see any industries that are more ready to move to data or should I rephrase that are there industries that are lagging that need to get going so the most important customers we have are big banks, financial institutions, also telco companies. They have realized from some time ago that the data and absolutely big data uh, is very important to drive their new business strategies, uh, attract or know uh, new customers for customer insight, for fraud detection, um, also to, to prevent churn. And this, these uh, sectors have been very active also, to, also in, in Europe. But we see lately uh, some other sectors are joining the big data wave especially retail. We see a very interesting momentum yeah, in retail. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think it's worldwide. And so they're, they're, you know, probably they came with a situation where they didn't care who was buying, um, you know, who was buying a cloth. And now they're absolutely interested in knowing uh, who is who and who is doing what before and after they're buying this piece of cloth. And what we're seeing also is like a uh, merge between the physical world and the digital world. Yeah, yeah. Because we see that all the patterns that people is able to understand from the e-commerce, now they wanted to have it also in the physical world. So we tell you, we see also trend in the retail, like you know, digitalizing the stores, datafying retail stores. So the information you get from the movements of the people around the stores is equivalent to the movements that you follow people when they are navigating in the web. So it's a very interesting moment. So also. that Internet of Things, like the devices exactly. that track everything you do. That's a whole new world of opportunities. So do you think that's where, if so, if we talk next year in London, mm -hmm. Is that where the big change in this market's going to come from, is all the machine data that's being generated? Or where do you think we're going to be 12 months from now in this data world? I see that uh, the change will come from the Internet of Things. That's, that's the new thing we see. I have my, my personal opinion is that we are in this datafying process of everything. And that brings a lot of opportunities to uh, get data from sources and from objects and from even business processes we were never were thought of. Uh, off. And I also see a trend that we have been focusing probably the last two um, years in customer analytics. And I think it is the time to move to operational analytics. So I think there's a lot of opportunities also in manufacturing and industry to gain uh, operational efficiency thanks to big data and Internet of Things. Excellent.
Excellent. Karma, we hope to see you in London next Thank year. You. Thank you. Thank you.